Hello everyone, I'm Micah Manticore, and welcome to the Room 4, Old Sins. Now, if you haven't watched, or played, the Room 3, and seen all the endings, I would recommend going and doing that before you start this video, because I don't know which one is going to be the canon ending for the Room 3 leading into this, if it leads into it at all. So, I'll give you a second to go check that out real fast, and then um, you can come back here. Got it? Cool. All right, let's jump in. Because I'm very curious to see what uh, ending it was. I've searched every room in the house but this attic. I won't get much further in the dark. I think it's broken. I'll need the screwdriver for my case. Ooh. My notebook holds all the information I was given for this assignment. <clears throat> Notorious engineer dismissed from the Royal Institute, Mr. Edward Lockwood, provoked fury of the Royal Institute. Subject profile, name Edward Lockwood, age 32, height 176 centimeters. Notes, trained as a mechanical engineer, dabbled in chemistry. Marriage to Abigail Waldegrave raised status, led to assistant position of the Royal Institute. Position last one year. Dismissal occurred due to unspecified misconduct. Deceased pioneer bequeaths the state to only daughter. Renowned artist Miss Abigail Lockwood inherits troubled Waldegrave Manor. Poison chalice. Burdened with debt. I can't read the little print. Spouse profile. Name Mrs. Abigail Lockwood, nay Waldegrave. Age 28. Height 162 centimeters. Note. Classically trained artist, known for funding exhibitions. Only child of the esteemed Hugo Waldegrave. Marriage to Edward was controversial. On her father's death, Abigail inherited Waldegrave Manor and family's substantial debt. A map of Waldegrave Manor, that'll be handy. Collector report. 1st November. Mr. Lockwood's reports to my employers have ceased. Probable inf interference by his wife. Current whereabouts unknown. 12th November. Police search of Waldegrave Manor yields nothing. These matters are far beyond their understanding. 14th November. My employers insist the sample remains within Waldegrave Manor. By now, its effects will be unmistakable to a trained eye. Find the trail. Follow it to the source. And it's blank. Is there something further back? That'd be cool. There's nothing further back. There's no chance. <laughs> Ooh, spooky. Oh. Oh. What? What was that? I need a better look. Hmm. That's the manor! A dollhouse? Something isn't right. Investigate the dollhouse. Alright, let's get it. Oh, what? I don't have the lens yet. The surface looks unusual. I'll need something else for my case. I'm gonna explore the rest of it first. Maybe there's nothing to explore until I until I go in the house. Everyone has secrets. Mine just happen to be hidden in this box. Thank you. 
The eyepiece. I'll need to open this for it to be any use. Ooh. That's cool. Break the seal. Find the null. Sometimes the eyepiece can be used to see things that are otherwise hidden. I should use the eyepiece to examine the dollhouse. What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh, I corrected it. it we're good. What? Is that the craftsman's key? Kind of looks like the craftsman's key. Oh, that's cool. It's shade, it's formatted differently than the third one was. Foyer. Etiquette for husband and wife. Oh, what have I done? Ah, what have I done? They are loading apparatus for by the cartload, and I see my husband transform into a wide-eyed child. He hadn't been this an he hasn't been this animated since he left the Royal Institute. The men work in silence and stand awkwardly in my presence, heads down, silent. They will not hold my gaze. They look so desperate I move Oh, they look so desperate, I move aside, stay out of their way. Why are certain men so threatened by women of intelligence? They will warm to me as they come to know me, I am sure. The main thing is that Edward is working again. Okay. That's all. It seems the books in this dollhouse hold more than their covers suggest. I suspect they will be key to uncovering what happened here. Let me spin that wheel! Well, shit. What if I spin that wheel? Ah! A brass mechanical coin. What? What? That's crazy. It goes there. Ink. Ink. Let me see that shit. Okay, what is that mark for? Oh, bitch. Okay. Hmm. Thank you, yoink. This looks like it belongs on the dollhouse. Okay, got it. Boof. Seal, the null must lie beyond. Oh, that was cool. <clears throat> Hello.
Hello. Oh no, one is missing. Yeah, boy. Whoa, that zoomed me way out. What is that? I can't do anything with that yet, but that's okay. All right, back in this room, I guess. Hello? Ding dong? <laughs> oh no, don't crash. Oh, thank God. Gotta double click. Well, this will do the same thing. On it. Hey. Yeah, boy. My stuff is getting a little choppy, so I'm sorry if the the recording is a little wonky at this point. I'm not sure why, because I've been doing this for a second, so like it can't be too stupid. That was easy. Mink. Done. Give me that. Whatever that is. Let me see that. Ah, uh, well, all right. Hello. Ooh. Ah! Okay, that's funky. Okay... Okay, so if I um, if I flip this one, but I leave no, because I have to. No, that was wrong. Actually, I'm fine. I can flip that and then go beep beep, and then if I flip this over and latch that, but I latch that and I flip that over, then that leaves these two. Bink, bink. And I win. I win. Ooh, do I have to... Oh, I just grab it. Okay. found the seal my employer spoke of. It is weakened, but far from broken. I am clearly on the path to finding the null element. Should I do one more, or should I call it here? I'll do a little bit more. That artifact I picked up. I think I should take a closer look at it. Wowee! What the heck? I got a swan. I bet it goes on that. Yoink. What is this? I want to take a look at this. I 
don't think I can make it serve its purpose yet. Um. Aha! There you go. There you are, you bastard. Pink. Lit. I have lit of the dollhouse. You know what? I may end it here because my computer's freaking out a little bit. So, thanks so much for watching. Please click subscribe if you haven't already. I'd appreciate that very much. At 250 subs, I'm giving away this shaker. It matches my hat. I'm giving away that as well as a tub of dubby of the winner's choice. Um, I was drinking dubby throughout this episode. Uh, through my tree planted shaker. I was drinking uh, Push and Punch, which is one of my favorite flavors. So go check them out. Uh, use code MyCommandCore at w.gg or there's a code in the link in the description uh, for 10% off your order. I love this stuff. It rules. Um, but thanks again for watching. Uh, please join the Discord. Uh, we're over there uh, just having some fun. Um, I post new videos over there as well as just kind of chat with people. Um, not super active right now, but I'm working on that. Um, gonna make some changes here soon, I think. So uh, we'll get there when we get there. Thank you so much for being here. I hope the rest of your day is as awesome as you are. Goodbye. <laughs>